Attorney General Brian Frost and I are here today to announce that earlier this morning, the state of Maryland and the District of Columbia filed a lawsuit in federal court against the President of the United States. The suit alleges that President Trump is flagrantly violating the Constitution, which explicitly bars presidents from receiving gifts or inducements from foreign or domestic government entities. He's pitched the Trump International Hotel to foreign diplomats and to government officials. He appears frequently at Trump establishments using his role as president as a marketing device to raise their public profile. He's paid by companies owned by foreign governments, including China, which lease space at Trump Tower. He continues to take money from foreign governments, including Saudi Arabia, India, Afghanistan, and Qatar, who own property in Trump World Tower and pay him charges associated with those properties. President Trump's businesses and his dealings violate the Constitution's anti-corruption provisions, known as the emoluments clauses. The most important point is to prevent the president from putting his interests over our interests, over your interests, over the interests of Marylanders and all Americans. We do not sue the president of the United States casually. I wish President Trump had addressed these issues, these violations himself, but he has not and they must be addressed and remedied.